this is our part exchange from yesterday for the Fiat 500. It's a 56 plate, 1.6 petrol. And it's got 12 months MOT. It needs a bit of a good clean on it, to be fair. So the first thing I'm going to do is give it a bit of a detail and then see what we've got to work with and decide whether it's going to go down to auction or stick it on the trade page. There is a couple of lights on the dashboard. For some reason, there's a powertrain light, but I did scan it yesterday and it shows up as um, a fault with the, I think it's over the throttle sensor or the pedal. Looking at the history on it yesterday, it's already had a pedal. So, unless they put a second hand one on it, it's gone again, I'm not sure. Uh, but I've got to do a little bit more investigating and hopefully we'll, uh, we'll get a little bit closer and be able to diagnose it. Giving up your dreams to your silly demons We're diamonds in the dust, oh why can't you see it? Keep getting under your thick skin, trying on not Building and resting your weaknesses Swimming around in your bloodstream got it finished took a bit of work I'll be honest with you but she's she's come up quite tidy I don't think there's a lot wrong with her body wise the inside needed a good good once over but what we're gonna do as you know um, we've had this launch oh uh, we've had this launch um, diagnostic machine given to us so we're gonna try it out obviously in true fashion so let's put you over here. Oh, that's a good little spot, isn't it? He knows he's running. It's a bit cold today. Alright, so plug this in. And we'll see what fault codes that it gives us. Now this also charges while it's plugged into your port. So that's handy. Right, it's found it this time. Click OK. Now this will work off the hotspot on your phone as well, so it's pretty handy, so you can be totally mobile anywhere. It will work without the internet, but uh, with the internet it'll tell you the, the answer to the fault codes. Right, so it's, it's green at the minute. Green. Right, first one, instrument cluster. Second one, powertrain control module. That's it. So, let's see what we've... what we've got to do. Diagnostic report for Ford. Send now that will also now send the fault codes to my email so I can look at it on the laptop when I get back in the office. Right, so that's gone. Okay, so I click back. Um, right, so we've got uh, right, first one instrument cluster accelerator position sensor out of range, right? So I could probably do that by putting the ignition on, um, holding the pedal to the floor slowly and then taking it off, see if that will bring it back into range. If if it has had a pedal and then they haven't recalibrated it, maybe that's that uh, problem. Um, abnormal powertrain control model, throttle pedal, position sensor, circuit error, throttle position sensor, switch D, circuit range performance error, and theft detect vehicle immobilized. That's probably because I haven't started it up, I don't know. Um, and the rest is fine. So, 
what are we thinking? Um, now, I've already sent the report, haven't I? So we'll clear the codes. Alright. And we need to clear that code. Right, so cleared them. The powertrain light's gone off, which you can see. And we can start it up and see if it comes back on. It's come straight back on. The engine management light's gone off, but the powertrain light's come back on. So I need to be a bit of Cluso on this one and do some investigating. Right, so I'm just going back to basics on this. I've took the negative lead off the battery because I'm thinking it had a uh, it had a pedal a few years ago. Now, is that pedal going to break four or five years ago? So is it going to break again? Depends whether they put a second hand one on or a new one on. Um, so I'm thinking, has it been like this ever since? Because I think that the uh, the lady that owned it before, she sort of put up with the lights on and just left it. Um, because because it was still running okay now i took the negative off uh, i've left that for half an hour i'm going to put that back on then i'm going to recalibrate the accelerator pedal uh to see if to see if that uh if it all works again so i'm going to try it see if the lights go out and um reset the lights again and see if they stay off if they don't i've got the option of probably trying a new pedal or it could be the fact that, which is known to these, the back of the um, instrument cluster, the soldering does go on these. Now, if anyone's got any advice, do I try an accelerator pedal? Or do I just think it's probably gonna be beyond the dash which I can see we're heading for here? Um, because it does make me wonder why she hasn't just had a pedal put on. Um, or has she had a pedal put on? and it didn't do anything this is what this is the guessing game that you get with second hand cars isn't it now i've just put it all back together and i've recalibrated the pedal and we've still got the lights on i know they're flickering on the camera probably but it's the powertrain light and the engine uh, management light so i'm going to try and reset with the code reader and see if they go off this time. Run to the hills. Do, 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 do. Remember that? I just want to. Do you think Probably not. Full focus. Resolution. What have we decided to do? We have decided to take it to auction. Well, we, it may be as simple as just putting an uh, accelerator pedal on. It may be as simple as that, but I don't think we're going to take the risk. We're just going to let someone someone else sort it out. They can have it for a fair price. It's only a part X. Um, we did give reasonable money on it, so but it could be a cheap fix for someone and it could end up like a 1995 or even a 2495 car because it's only done 71,000. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget. Like, comment, share and subscribe and make sure you use Vehicle Sports to check all your vehicles that you're going to buy and don't forget to click the link in the description and use the code VALLEY20 and you'll get 20% off. So until next time. Adios amigo. Hey, 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 hey.